Hi, my name is Dayla Miller and I'm the Program Director of Total Health Conferencing. This tutorial video is intended to take you through our 2022 conference app, show you how to navigate the live sessions and network with your peers and colleagues. For this tutorial, I'll be using a generic Total Health meeting as an example, but no matter what meeting you attend, the features and functionalities will be the same. Let's dive right in. Prior to the event, you'll receive an email with a link to download the app. Once downloaded, you'll be asked to enter your email used at registration and create your own password. From there, you'll be able to edit your profile, accept the terms, and enter into the app. Once in the app, select which meeting you're attending. We encourage the first thing you do is set up your profile. On the bottom right of the screen, click on the me icon. On this page, you'll be able to ensure all your information is correct and add any additional personal touches you'd like, including a profile picture and a brief bio. You can also edit your accounts and allow other attendees to access the information you make available. If you do not want your email address to be shared with the connections you make, I would recommend removing it from this page. Once you've set up your profile, click done and you'll be able to log in at your convenience using the password you created. Let's click back to the homepage. You're now in the conference app that features all the information you need for the meeting. On the welcome page, you can watch a welcome video from our program chairs that explains best tips to have a successful conference and quickly navigate to the featured exhibitors and non-CME sessions available during the meeting. Here, there are also quick links to our feedback survey and how to obtain your CME credits. Let's jump into setting your schedule. Head over to the agenda tab. This is where you'll be able to see the full agenda for the meeting. From here, you can add specific sessions to your schedule to fully customize your experience. Just click the plus sign button next to the title and they will be added to your My Agenda tab at the top of the screen. If you see two sessions on the calendar at the same time, you'll have to choose which one you'd like to attend. Please note that our non-CME sessions are not available after the live session occurs and all of the CME sessions will be available for viewing after the meeting concludes. When viewing the agenda, you wanna make sure you're on the correct day. 15 minutes before the live session starts, you will see a join live stream button appear. Click the button to join. For in-person attendees, please refrain from clicking join live stream as you'll be at the presentation in person and rather just click into the session. As you tune in, whether in-person or virtual, we encourage you to ask your questions in the Q&A section, participate in polls if available and take notes. You'll also be able to view the description of the session, see the speakers, and download files all within the session tab. Once you've selected all the sessions you'd like to attend, you'll be able to view them in the My Agenda tab at the top of the screen. If you wanna make any edits, simply click on the check mark to remove the session from your schedule. Recorded sessions will be available for viewing on the app the week following the conference. Please ensure you enable your app notifications as we'll send out announcements with any important information you need to know throughout the meeting. Another feature you'll wanna take advantage of is our networking tab. On this page, you can search, sort, and filter attendee lists and select who you'd like to connect with. When you're viewing the list of attendees, you'll either see a contact button or an add button. Contact refers to an individual who hasn't logged into the platform just yet, an ad refers to an individual who has. When you click on the contact button, you can send a personal message and they'll be notified through email that you'd like to start a conversation. When you click add, that person will receive a notification within the connections tab. They will then click on their connection request bell and add you as a connection. Once added, you've officially made the connection and you can now view their profile within the connections tab. From the attendee profile, you can send a message or propose a meeting time with in-person attendees. You'll be able to access all messages on the Messages tab. You can think of the Connections tab as an address book of all the connections you made at the meeting and the Messages tab as an inbox of all the conversations you engaged in. Throughout the day, please head over to the Exhibitors tab and select which booth you'd like to enter. Within the booths, you'll find helpful resources and information, as well as the ability to talk now with available booth representatives. You can download files, watch videos, and request follow-up, depending on what each company has displayed. If you're having any trouble or need any assistance throughout the meeting, you can visit the FAQ tab or chat with the live tech support 
on the tech support tab. We're excited to have you attend a total health meeting. If you have any questions, please reach out to me. We're looking forward to connecting with you in person or on the conference app.